Hey there, food lovers. Welcome to another mouthwatering episode of Foodology. Today, we're diving into the world of pan-fried trout, a classic dish that's sure to impress your taste buds. Before we get started, let's talk about why pan-frying is the way to go when it comes to trout. First off, it's quick and easy. We're talking 8 to 10 minutes from start to finish. Plus, pan-frying gives the fish a crispy, golden brown exterior while keeping the inside tender and flaky. Alright, let's dive into the recipe. Here's what you'll need. For butterfly trout, cleaned and scaled. All-purpose flour. Salt and pepper. Butter and olive oil. Lemon wedges. First things first, pat your trout fillets dry with paper towels. This step is crucial for getting that crispy skin we all crave. Next, mix some flour, salt, and pepper in a shallow dish. Dredge the trout in the seasoned flour, making sure to shake off any excess. This light coating will protect the fish from burning and give it a fantastic texture. Now, heat up a large skillet over medium-high heat and melt some butter with a splash of olive oil. Once the butter starts sizzling, it's time to lay those beautiful trout fillets in the pan, skin side down. Let them cook for about 3 to 5 minutes, resisting the urge to poke and prod. Trust me, the fish will let you know when it's ready to flip. When the time is right, use a thin, wide spatula to carefully flip the trout. Cook for another 3 to 5 minutes on the other side until the fish is golden brown and nearly opaque. You'll know it's done when it flakes easily with a fork. Just be careful not to overcook it, nobody likes dry, rubbery fish. Once your trout is cooked to perfection, transfer it to a plate and serve it up with some lemon wedges on the side. The bright, citrusy flavor of the lemon perfectly complements the mild, slightly sweet taste of the trout. Now, I know some of you might be wondering about the skin. Do you eat it or not? Well, I'm here to tell you that trout skin is not only edible but also delicious when cooked right. It adds a lovely crispy texture and a ton of flavor to the dish. If you're using fresh-caught trout, you might need to do a little extra work to get it ready for the pan. Don't worry, it's not as complicated as it sounds. Just follow these simple steps. 1. Cut open the belly and remove the guts. 2. Rinse the fish inside and out. 3. Remove the head and tail. 4. Butterfly the trout by cutting along the backbone and removing the rib cage. And there you have it, a perfectly prepped trout, ready for pan frying. Before we wrap up, let's talk about storage. If you have any leftover fried trout, you can keep it in an airtight container in the fridge for up to two days. To reheat, just pop it in the oven, air fryer, or even the microwave. Thanks for joining us on this tasty adventure. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful content.